All right, Joey Stroop here, Bike Band Performance. Right now we have the RPM header with a free flowing three inch straight through muffler. Nothing fancy, uh, just a few people had said that it needs a free flowing muffler. Uh, so we're doing some free flowing muffler tests to see what, uh, how the headers actually work with free flowing mufflers. So we try to be fair and honest here. People say we should test it, we test it. So let's go into a run here. We'll do three in a row, then uh, compare the average just like we've done with all of them. And we do have the ECU uh, RPM extended. Uh, other than that, it is 100% stock original calibration. Do keep in mind that the uh, stock rev limit is 8650, so we are going beyond that, uh, just to show you what the header will do up at higher RPM. Here's the second run. graph looks like um, blue is stock red is header alone um, with stock muffler and then black we're gonna go back into one more run still running out there uh, header does get cherry red while you're running so don't be surprised if you see that Uh, looks like that run peaked out at uh, 244.6. I'm going to average the uh, uh, last three runs together and hang on one second. I'll be right back. All right, I do have the average up now. So blue is stock muffler, stock headers, stock tune with just rev limit extended, obviously. Uh, red is RPM header with stock muffler. Uh, black is RPM header with stock muffler, uh, ECU over rev extended, uh, completely stock mapping. And like I showed earlier, that's the just straight through muffler, nothing fancy, just a straight through uh, kind of glass back style muffler. So let's go. Peaked out at uh, 244.4 at 85.75, and this is the average of three runs now. Uh, you can see right up here, uh, 85, 75. Uh, the rev limit in the stock ECU is 8650, so, I mean, it is still going above that, but it looks like if we remove the header, so that's versus stock, and we can actually see uh, airflow so airflow of the RPM header, once we reached 7,900, all of a sudden the, the RPM header and free flowing muffler uh, does exceed stock. Uh, we are also gonna do a uh, stock header with a three inch free flowing muffler, just to show you what that does, because it's only fair to compare apples to apples. So uh, we'll compare these uh, headers with a free-flowing muffler against a stock header with a free-flowing muffler. So 
that's it for this video. Uh, please like this. If you like this com content, uh, comment. If you want to see some other content, comment if you, uh, if you think I'm, I should do something different or if you like what I'm doing. Uh, thanks. See you next time.